Okay, we're here at ASAP Rental, and guess what? It's cold and it's windy and it's kind of snowing. We have a patio heater here. You and I are both going to learn at the same time how to light this thing for the very first time. So, bear with me. First thing we have to do, just like in your barbecue, we have to turn on the propane tank. Ah, but where's the propane tank? Hiding under here. We have to lift this up. Now you can hold it if you want, or you can balance it, whichever. Turn on your tank. Sorry if you can't see me. Turn on your tank. That's on. It's on? Okay. Close her back up. Next thing. We are going, I'm going to take my gloves off and make it easier for me, okay? And probably my hat, so I'm cold. Okay, we turn this knob. It has a white mark called a calibration mark at the top. We're going to turn it here. We're going to hold it, and then we're going to press the igniter. We're going to press the igniter. We're going to press the igniter. I wasn't pressing it hard enough. There was nothing wrong with the igniter. If you hear it lit, I heard it go poof, it's lit. I can feel the heat coming off it. Beautiful heat. We're gonna hold it for 30 seconds because we wanna make sure that the safety switch inside is heated up enough, it's going to keep going. Okay, lovely heat. Now, if you don't wanna leave it on high necessarily, you can turn it down all the way to low if you want, or all the way up to high. It's so easy and you're not going to believe me but this is the first time I've done this okay now a couple of safety features we have to talk about because safety does come first and let me put my gloves on again my hands are cold 24 inches away from this baby which is probably I'm out of the camera now 24 inches two feet nothing around it or you're gonna lose it and above it three feet tall which means you may want to drag this thing into your gazebo or your little party tent, but don't do it because you're going to burn it. Okay? That's it. That's all there is to it. If you forget all this, something really handy dandy here. ASAP has rolled out QR codes. All you have to do, see the QR code? Scan the QR code. Ta-da! You have now been taken to a website that gives you instructions on how to light this. What to do if you have problems, because you can light it manually, although as you can see, you really didn't have to. I'm having a hard time dragging myself away from it because it's so nice and warm. But that's all there is to it. Now it's time to shut it down. Simply turn that back to where it was, push it in, and turn it up. And don't forget, we have to turn off our propane tank because safety's first. I'm Fran at ASAP Rental. Don't forget QR codes, it's where it's at.